All right, girls, this week we've got something a little bit different for you. Um, you've been doing a great job of updating the Google form with your daily progress in the uh, training program that we put together. This week I'm going to add an element to it. It's a challenge, all right? We're going to use, it's a ball skills challenge. It's something you could probably use in lieu of the ball skills or fast footwork section of the training program that we have already. Um, basically what I've got set up, and some of you might even recognize this, we've got 11 cones set up out here. Each cone's about three feet apart. You're going to go through a dribbling progression of nine different exercises. In addition to that, I'm going to create a Google form. All right, the link will be in the in the uh, caption of this video. Go to that Google form, input your time for each of these nine sections. So you'll have nine times total. Once you've input your, I'm going to ask you each to do that once, at least once. Okay, please. So for every person who completes the Google form at least one time, you get one entry into a drawing, and we'll get to that in a second. In addition to that, if you go through the exercise and you beat your scores, and I hope that you do, I hope that you get better throughout the week, go ahead and update those scores. Put in new scores. I would. There's no limit on the number of entries that you can put in, and I would love to see somebody put in five, six, seven different days worth of work. And to encourage that, we got a bonus for you. So for each day that you upload a video, and we've, we've just added Instagram, we've still got Twitter, we've got Facebook, upload a video to any one of those platforms one video per day and add the hashtag steamers 7 g I'm gonna give you a bonus entry into the drawing so you get one entry per video for daily video limit one per day and you get one entry if you complete all nine elements and input your times into the Google form now what's the drawing for so we, we gave this some thought I know we did Lululemon in the past we've tried Starbucks in the past um, I thought, and, and Michelle thought it'd be a cool idea to try Dick's Sporting Goods. You know, Dick's had some really cool stuff, whether you're into soccer or volleyball, or you need a new headband, or you want to buy a cute tennis skirt. I don't know. Whatever you girls want to do with it, you'll have a gift card to do it for yourselves. So, that's the challenge. Now on to the rules. All right, girls, so here's the rules. you got 11 cones set up, as you can see behind me. I want each cone roughly one big step apart. So I set these up for myself. These are about 32 inches apart. And by apart, I mean middle of middle to middle, okay? Not the gap in between. Do up to 36 inches. So that's about as far as you wanna get, guys. If, if you've got this much space in between, that's gonna be really easy. I wanna challenge you guys. I want you to get better. To that point, skill is better than speed in this. So if you miss a cone, guess what? You either keep, you either come back and get it, or you have to start all over. Don't skip cones to get a better time, guys. You're only cheating yourselves. Um, there's nine elements in total. Again, we'll get to that here in a second. And then the last piece of this, once you're done and you've done each section and you've timed it, upload those times into the Google form. The best scores are going to get a bonus prize. Go. Shen.
make it work for me.